Hi everyone. <clears throat> Welcome back from our Homeworld 3, the campaign. This is Hook. Building and utilizing additional support frigates will speed up mothership repairs. That explains their tech. Passive ROE set. Maintain tracking. Support frigate is now ready. Support frigate is now ready. Don't I have... Channel open, stand by. Oh, I can't move yet, that's why I'll Mothership all at 30%. My board showed green for main drives. Engines now online. Good work, repair teams. Are we hyperspace capable? Our remaining core is in bad shape. Casing cracked, power conduits sheared. Protocols crashed. And that's just what we can fix. Understood. Flagging all your damage control requests as priority one. We are in unknown territory, and we need to be able to jump at a moment's notice. Mothership repairs proceeding apace. Powder hall conduits 23% functional. It's getting thick out there. Stay tight, maintain flight data link. Advise crew to clear affected signs. Don't want anyone ending up in front of the hull. Oh, there's the probe. Probe production complete. Probe launching. Mothership hiding in the... The mothership has entered the nebula. Objective complete. Core physical repairs are as good as they're going to get without help. Cybernetic systems are still failing, but I have a few more ideas. Acknowledged. Notify me as soon as we are hyperspace capable. We don't want to be in this trapped system any longer than we have to. Mothership Hall Integrity at 45%. Alpha Team, I need more mainstay braces fabricated. No, I... okay. It's clear now we have fallen into a trap. One moment we were on course for the Noctua 27 system, and the next... Something forced a hyperspace exit into our quantum waveform and dropped us through the Colligate. I can't imagine the power that would take. But now that I know how the progenitor tech they're using feels, I can modify our field amplifiers so it never happens again. Unfortunately, at this point, it doesn't matter how prepared we are. Because we'll never make it to our objective on one partially operational core. According to our historical data, the only gate with a progenitor facility capable of repairing our cores is located in the Naraka Gate Complex. With only one functional core, Naraka is now out of range. So we will have to use the Trinity Gate to get there. Whoever this enemy is, they've been shadowing us since we arrived in system. The attack will come when it's optimal for them. We must gather resources and reinforce our fleet. Concentrations of resources are located here. Deploy oh, resource below. controllers to these locations immediately. Reserve life support available throughout the ship. Delta team, we need to get med bays 8 and 13 back online ASAP. Probe is away. Coming through. Receiving. 
Mothership hull integrity at 65%. Landing bays, clear. Go. Go for bombers. This hide and seek didn't end well last time. Stay alert. Moving to position. Mothership hull integrity at 75%. Resource operations underway. Ugh. Too many damn gussies. Subsystem drag time is increasing. They don't kind of well Got though. It confirmed. Fleet, we have a G Max class freighter here. She's a mess. Hull compromised, debris everywhere. Her bridge looks intact, though. She's responding to my transponder query. I'm seeing activity out there. Let's be ready to move. Confirmed. Spinning up now. Maintain corrections as needed. Watch for options. This Let's is the drop right there. To ourselves. Looks like she had worse luck than we did with the gate transit. Wait a second. Is that what I think it is? Fleet, this is Controller 34. We found something. Looks like an assault frigate. From the fifth. The lost fifth? Are you sure? Already ran the whole designation. She's the frigate Hebeladin, last logged at Kasura Minor. Not responding to hails. No power readings. Approaching log. Target sync now. Okay, log down. Feed rate looks good. Keep us steady. Nice. Standing by. Use back. a resource controller to salvage that frigate immediately. We need to recover its logs. Oh, you send. Mothership hull integrity at 85%. All rescue teams report in. We still have unaccounted for. Recon here. Go for interceptor. Capture successful command. We're coming in from the cold. Tracking strike craft on approach. Meet them head on. Enemy strike craft closing. Look alive. Group two taking losses. Send message. We're not gonna make it. All hull breaches sealed. The mothership has been repaired. Objective complete. Alert. We are under attack. Eliminate this threat immediately. This is how they hit hard. Where do they get this tech? Undetermined. We are facing an unknown threat of equal or superior power. Possible progenitor origin. Could have told you that when they started ripping through our armor. Watch group two. They're taking losses. The enemy is using an anti-strike craft corvette. Recommend using bombers to engage. Clean kill. Receiving. Shut down! Shut it! You're within minimum burn range. All around. Group 2 taking losses. Priority alert. We are losing strike craft. We're breaking up! Group two lost. Away. Use resource controllers to recover the wrecked frigate. 
Recon production complete. Probe launching. The Hagaran frigate wreck has been recovered. Objective complete. The drifting container boxes are packed with resources. Begin salvage operations and collect those containers. Reporting critical damage. Assault frigate construction template now available. These powerful attack vessels will allow us to counter the enemy strike craft we have been facing. Area is depleted. Request reassign. Ship logs now. Unknown hostiles eliminated. Threat contained. Objective complete. Signature detected. I saw something in the corridor there. How oh. are they doing this? That gate window reads like a long jump, but these ships have no cores, no navigators. Combat alert. Hostile task forces enter the AO. Defend the mothership at all costs. Command, this is not good. We need to jump out now. Every time I tried to feed the core the navigation matrix, it collapses. I need more time. Understood. Dealing with incoming enemy threat is now priority one. Consider salvaging to be a secondary objective. vessels on approach. We need to buy command some time. Operations. Cargo assault frigate ready for action. Confirming positive log on capture. We're coming home. Just tell us where to park it, command. Understood? We are inbound. Assault frigate ready for action. Caution, resource controller is under fire. Second enemy frigate en route to the mothership. Destroy it. It's getting pretty 
hot out here, Command. Assault frigate ready for action. Caution, resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Probe is away. Alert, resource controller integrity at 50% and falling. Assault frigate ready for action. Moving to shadow. You see us lead? Argushan copies. Adding you to our net. Warning. Alert. The enemy is attacking our resource controllers. Send reinforcements to guard them. Intel. Damaged core is finally holding a resonance. Not perfect, but it will hold. Just need to finish spooling up. When we are ready, we will have to go immediately, or risk quantum collapse. Understood. But when we initiate jump, we will need to dock strike craft, or they will be left behind. Until then, we need our strike craft defending the mothership. Timing will be crucial. Core spooled, ready to initiate hyperspace. Be advised, only capital ships will wake jump with a mothership. Undocked strike craft will be lost. You've got you covered, Lady Imogen. Go. Alert, strike craft taking losses. One suffering losses. Assault frigate ready for action. Priority alert. High strike craft losses being reported. Resource control assault frigate ready for action. Group one is in trouble. Alert, strike craft losses mounting. Resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Interceptor production complete. Caution. Resource controller hull. Command. Akadath Farron. Akadath Farron. All hands. Stand by for hyperspace. Burden remain. I think I got most of my shit docked. At least I'm pretty sure I did. I mean, the two boxes were on the way, so I should not have lost that. Imogen. Moments, moments are eternal. Why does it have to be you? There's something I've been searching for, and I may have finally found it, but it's very far from here. Earth? Always remember the things I've taught you, Imogen, no matter what the future brings. 
You are going to burn very bright, my little star. I know goodbyes are hard. Let me sing our lullaby. Ponder child, where is your home? You know the way, follow the stone. Beneath golden dunes lie silver bones. Among the stars, you're not alone. Can you hear me? She can. coordinates locked in. Space complete. We have arrived at Trinity. God, how long it took to remake everything is amazing. Intel, we may have a problem. Hyperspace navigation is compromised. I am not alone. There are others. Be advised. I'm reading you, Fleet Command. Eyes are open. Intel trying to connect to gate systems, but they are locked down. Whoever we are fighting, they can deny us gate access. Controller is on the move. U.S. active. We are deep within the anomaly, hostile territory. Enemy force levels and position unknown. We must use this gate to jump onwards to Naraka, where we can repair the cores. Capturing these three data spires will give us control of the gate systems. Lack of data on enemy forces in position makes caution a priority. A nearby tunnel entry point is located here. Use the tunnel to approach the spire undetected. Passive scan data coming in. There are multiple small power generators out there. Stationary. Can't resolve further. A location of this size? You can bet they're out there. Engineering here. Production base system update done. Check your board. Group 1, reinforced. Railgun Corvettes are now available for research. They're designed to inflict damage on capital ships at long range. Channel open. Stand by. Group one is in trouble. Be advised, turret scanners are highly sensitive and will detect bombers as soon as they fire. Probe ready. Probe launching. Setting scan vector. Probe is away. Research complete. Send message. Upgrade available. We can upgrade systems to allow temporary boost to the mothership's rate of fire. 
Attention fleet. The enemy is fielding a new class of corvette. Scans indicate they are proficient at engaging frigate and capital class vessels. Mothership upgrade confirmed. Fleet bomber lead. We are in position. Tunnels will mask our strike craft's approach. Spire captured. Accessing gate database now. I'm in. Upgrade complete. Probe is away. Gun Corvette complete. Send message. Adjust scope angles. Let's go. Confirming target vendor. I'm ready. New heading set. Fleet, this is Bomber Lead. In position. Go for recon. One data spire captured. Two remaining. Entering the progenitor structure. Confirmed. Showing reduced sensor profile on you now. Production complete. Probe launching. Probe is away. Gain control of the two remaining data spires. Group one suffering losses. Thank you. 
Second data spire captured. Ready. I have access to the gate and its transit comms. Bad news. An enemy force is inbound. Roger that, Command. All ships, prepare for incoming. Caution. Engineering here. Production base system update available. We're ready for more. High on frigate research now available. Be advised, they are designed to engage capital ships at close range. These can't be the progenitors, but whoever they are, they carry the symbol of Sajuk, and they seem to know more about the gates than we do. We need answers, quickly. Suffering losses. Position noted. Inbound. Moving control. Second heavy damage. Attention. Set transmission. Alert. Strike craft losses mounting. Group one is in trouble. Research complete. Resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Group one, lost. Ops, update. Resource operations underway. Two data spires controlled. Only one remains. Ion frigate constructed. Objective complete. Upgrade complete. Caution. Resource controller taking damage. Railgun Corvette production complete. Forget oh, is ready. Five done. Command channel open. Move out. Maintain active scan all zones. New position set. Move us out. Alert. Resource controller hull integrity at fifty percent and falling. Interceptor production complete. Send message. Production complete. All three data spires captured. Objective complete. We now control the gate. Enemy frigates detected. This is an opportunity. We must capture an enemy vessel and interrogate its crew for additional intel. Well, shit. Use a resource controller to capture an enemy frigate. Ignorance is fatal in combat. We have to gather intelligence on the enemy. Command channel open. That did it. Ion frigate is ready. Target aging. Okay. Repairs underway. Transferring med kits as well. Looks 
Sensor contact, Corvette. Check screens. I caution, resource controller has been engaged. Alert, resource controller integrity at 50% and falling. Caution, resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Corvette production complete. Ion frigate is ready. Stand by for ship disassembly. Crew processing. Enemy frigate captured. Objective complete. Systems link established. Running decryption on all data. Boarding teams escorting the crew to interrogation. The captured frigate's orders have been decrypted. It was being directed to link up with an inbound task force. We can get the jump on them. <sighs> Combat alert. Prepare to ambush arriving enemy force. Controller here, go ahead. Damage near critical. Corvette copy. Engines in the full. Gunnery, we expect handoff and range on the enemy chest. Master. Quantum waveform detected from the gate. Trinity is active. Did it move automatically on its own? From Owen to my voice, you are intruding on her domain. We only entered this region of space because of the attacks on our world. Hyperspace is her domain. Hers alone. You will stand down. Who is she? And prepare to receive her wisdom. Name yourselves. We are her will, incarnate. What Fleet reporting critical damage to the copy. All ships, engage these incarnate and destroy their carrier group. Anti-strike craft turrets now available for research. Deploy around the spires for additional defense. Frigate is ready. Ready to cock. Railgun Corvette ready. Launching. Warning. A new class of enemy frigate has entered the AO. Energy readings suggest an ability to engage multiple targets simultaneously. Approach with caution. Caution. Resource controller has been engaged. Anti-strike craft turret construction template now available. Railgun Corvette production complete. Warning, resource controller nearing critical. At launch, anti-strike craft turrets are mobile and inactive. Deploy them on terrain to enable firing. Navigation link established. Punch back enemy strike craft, close back. Bomber production complete. Thank you. 
Enemy carrier destroyed. Eliminate all remaining enemy forces to ensure safe gate transit. Advance. Gun Corvette ready. Launching. Go ahead, send. Assault frigate ready for action. We have capture orders. Spin up collectors. Ion frigate is ready. Incarnate carrier group destroyed. Objective complete. Objectives complete. We're clear. Set course for the gate. Really? I can't. Okay. I mean, I have, what, 20, 30K? Yeah, that should be fine. I forget commitment on my mark. Gosh, you look really tall right there. Three, two, one, mark. The incarnate ship we captured was part of a larger force called the Fleet of the Veil. The crew exhibited very little independent thought when questioned. It's as if they exist only as an extension of their leader's will. The she we keep hearing about? An incarnate queen? Precisely. They believe her to be a progenitor reborn and that her great work will be to remake the galaxy. Ugh, zealots. Deluded fanatics. Worse than the Gulsian. I don't think it's all a delusion. If she succeeds in extracting and focusing all the power from the gate network, she could literally move stars. The data we recovered from the frigate Habeladin was very badly corrupted. Could you shunt the corrupted files to my consoles? Let me see if I can separate and reconstruct. Of course. The uncorrupted files indicate the Incarnate are obsessed with capturing the three original Progenitor cores. Perhaps that's why she disappeared. To protect the cores. That would track with what I'm seeing in the Habeladin logs. Looks like they ran as far as they could before wiping their nav data. It feels like we're closer to Karen's trail than we've ever been. That may be. But our objective is to repair the synthetic cores at Naraka and then push on to knock through a 27. Collision 
warning! Hazard! Hazard! Asteroids! Stand by for evasive maneuvers. We're getting out of here. Hull defense guns, online. Emergency repair crews to outer hull damage control positions. Full suits. Command, have we been redirected again? Negative. Our coordinates are right. The asteroids are not supposed to be here. Intel, nav data confirms this is the Narakage complex, but there is no historical record of an asteroid hazard at this location. Understood, Command. Running kinetic and telemetry sims to determine the source. Move to new position. We must relocate to a safe zone on the shadow side of the larger asteroids immediately. The sim has determined the first safe location ahead. Move the mothership to this location and provide defensive fire. God damn it. projections on making it through in one piece lower than I'd like. Keep the fleet close and the carcasson protect them. The mothership has arrived at the designated safe zone. Objective complete. Be advised, a wrecked and carnage ship has been identified in the field. Calculating optimal passage ahead. The damage is consistent with severe kinetic impact. No life signs. The wreck could have data about this asteroid storm. Acknowledged. Commence salvage operations. Group one designated. of the repair bay at Naraka was. It's difficult to theorize about the motivations of a race that disappeared over a hundred thousand years ago. But given the position of Naraka in relation to the rest of the gate network, I suspect we are approaching some sort of way station facility. 
In its day, it may have built and maintained a whole fleet of gate-building vessels. The trick now will be for me to convince the automated facility that we are one of those ships, and we need our hyperspace course repaired. Incarnate Rex salvaged. Objective complete. Interceptor ready. Railgun Corvette ready. Launching. The Incarnate shipwreck logs indicate they were on station and observing the asteroid storm. No idea why they didn't obey. I think I may have an answer. I've been translating the communication buffer, and their orders were to hold and record her will. Telemetry is confirmed we can exit the field here. Continue through the hazard. Use the larger asteroids as protection. Resource control. Progress is slow but steady. Maintain fleet escort of the mothership. Bomber production complete. Caution. Resource resource controller complete and ready for operation. Struck by an asteroid. How much more I bet there is a machine for me to have without being hit by an asteroid?
target is now ready. Support frigate is now ready. Support frigate is now ready. We've detected the remains of an incarnate carrier. Commence salvage operations. Frigate is now ready. The hull can't take many hits like that. The mothership has been struck by an asteroid. Dispatch a resource controller to capture that incarnate carrier. Engineering reports that despite heavy damage, the Naraka repair bay should be able to put both incarnate carriers back in operation. They are already a treasure trove of intelligence data, but I have a plan to turn those hulls into a nasty surprise for our enemies. Frigate is now ready. is now ready. There. Relocate. Carrier wrecks aboard. Good work. Source 
controller is under fire. Support frigate is now ready. Clear the asteroid store. Objective complete. Yeah, how that just asteroid just. sure there was an achievement for not getting hit by an asteroid. <sighs> we have determined that the asteroid storm at Naraka is a relatively recent event. The Incarnate used hyperspace to redirect the moon into an inhabited world. But why? An entire world destroyed. For what? I think this was another attempt to pin us down. We were never meant to escape the trap at the Kala Terminus. A mad god. Just like Baldro said. Don't forget he also called us an oblivious giant. Was he wrong? We're powerful, but do we really understand what we're up against? <sighs> We've managed to outmaneuver them again. So I wouldn't count us out just yet. Without our cores, it's only a matter of time before they corner us. The only place we can make repairs is at the Naraka Gate Complex. Unfortunately, data from the wrecked enemy carrier indicates the incarnate fleet of the Vale's home base is located here. They call it the Citadel, and it is the seat of their military commander, the War Sage. We heard that name from Baldro, too. We must assume this war sage will counterattack as we begin repairs, for the mothership is most vulnerable. How can you be so sure? <sighs> because it's what I would do. War sage. My plan is to form a defensive line at Naraka while you use the facility to repair our cores. Make no mistake, we aren't just fighting for our lives here. An enemy who would shatter a world just to slow us down isn't going to stop with us. This isn't about Higara now. This is about the whole damn galaxy.
right there. I see. Progenitor based systems online. Subverting incarnate recognition protocols. I'm in. Security system standing down. Access granted. The bay is responding. The mothership is in position. Core repairs commencing. Awaiting comparison sample. Cross reference candidate number 1042. Failed. System, prep reference test number 1043. Reference test 1043. Awaiting comparison sample. Failed. Insufficient correlation. System. Failed. System. Failed. <sighs> Insufficient correlation. System. Failed. Sands and sinners! This corruption has to be deliberate. It's too specific to be random. It's not star map data. Not military coding, already cross-checked historical data. Okay, focus, Imogen. Waveform as a data transform cipher. Working. Transform complete. Playback file retrieved. Play it. Cool. This is Karen Sajet, commander and navigator of the Kar Sajuk. Lady Karen? We were on a scientific expedition. We were attacked. Pursued by the Incarnate and their queen. Her forces overwhelmed us. Returning home was impossible. She is everywhere. She wanted me to abandon the fleet, to join her. She needs the progenitor cores. She must not be allowed to find them. I've dispersed the fleet and hidden the Carsage up here. System, open a secure private channel to Intel officer Isaac Paktu. Triple encryption. Isaac, Imogen. We know where Karen is. Only triple? She must not be allowed to find them. I've dispersed the fleet and hidden the Carsage up here. Fascinating. Rather than give the Queen what she wanted, Karen buried the Carsage in a mountain of ice. We have to find her, Isaac. If the Sajuk is even still there. Play the rest of it. Retrieve the cores. Dismantle them, if you must. Whatever it takes to keep them from her. Imogen, do not believe anything she says, no matter how tempting. I'm sorry. Karen is talking directly to me, Isaac. She needs my help. She's we idiot. can't risk another fleet to chase down a ghost command. For now, we need to stick to the plan and remove the clear and present danger in front of us. Are you ready? Only forward. Fight ice, all resources there. Ooh, I see something important there.
Hyperspace core repairs are well underway, and we control the gate complex, for now. Power readings in this facility are rising. The fleet of the Veil is coming. As core repairs will not be complete in time, defense is our mission objective. We will ambush the incoming forces from the moment they come through the hyperspace gate. The Karkushan's production facility has been upgraded and an initial defense force created. This force contains anti-strike craft turrets and mine layer frigates. Utilize all the advantages the structure gives us. Reinforce the existing turrets to create a gauntlet the incarnate will not survive. With a mothership docked at such a distance from the gate, utilize the carrier to construct and deploy forces right where they're needed. The clock is ticking. Come on! The projections anticipate a massive Fuck. enemy force. They cannot be allowed to reach the Carcassonne while she is vulnerable. Carrier holding at standby for forward deployment. Mine layer frigates and anti-strike craft turrets awaiting orders. Setting optimal course. Deploy all available turrets to maximize coverage on the incoming hostiles. The heavy torpedo turrets already in place excel at striking enemy capital ships. Furthermore, heavy torpedo turrets are now available for production. Priority alert. Gate initiation sequence detected. Ships are inbound. They are using the gate to mask their numbers. I can't sense anything else. Mine laying frigates green to go. Deploy mines along the transit path from the gate. Dropping presence now. Sensors keep an eye out for incoming. Estimated enemy arrival, T-5. Continue laying down defenses. Frontline turrets reinforced. Railgun Corvette production complete. Send message. Confirmed. Support autonomy authorized. Assault frigate ready for action. Use the carrier to build and deploy ships to forward positions. Gate quantum levels increasing along projected lines. Enemy arrival in T-4. Upgrade complete. Turrets reinforcing the midline position. Projected gate activation in three minutes. You heard him. Let's start dropping eggs. Prepping for dispersal. Now be ready to set an evasion course if someone notices us. On standby. Dispenser crew, 
through. Check screens for dispersal pattern. Dropping presence now. Sensors keep an eye out for incoming. Frontline mines placed. Combat simulations are all resulting in failure. Continue improving defenses. Enemy forces will arrive in one minute. Prepare for contact. The incarnate attack has begun. The fleet of the Veil is her hand. Submit to her will or cease to be. There is another choice. All units, engage and destroy. The more sage decrees, the forward wave intersect the minefield for those that will follow. On Combat alert. This attack force is led by carrier class vessels. They are a priority target. Destroy the hostile carriers. Suppression frigate construction template now available. Use them to lay down area fire on multiple targets. Proximity alert. Enemy fleet vectoring in. Repel these forces. complete.
Watch the blast radius. Caution. Carrier has been engaged. Alert. Enemy strike craft are using brakes in the gate structure to vector directly to the mothership. in trouble. Suppression frigate is now ready. Mine layer frigate is now ready. Incarnate vectoring towards the Carcushan. The wave of enemy vessels is subsiding. All ships, good work. Keep holding the line. Reinforce defensive perimeter immediately. Engineering has developed a further enhancement to strike craft armor. Research to upgrade our ships. Initial battle analytics indicate the enemy was ramping up its use of capital ships. Ready. Copy, please. Echo backwards to full prioritization. Upgrade complete. Advised, I'm picking up another quantum surge in the gate complex. More incarnate ships are inbound. Go Mothership Auto Repair upgrade available. This will enhance and equip support teams to constantly repair the Kushan. Well, this won't be as good as mine, but better than venting into space until a sub frigate can pass us. That's always nice. Interceptor production complete.
get these enemy strike craft off us. On their carrier, start to run. Emergency shutdown. The online target. Corvette destroyed. Scratch. Upgrade complete. One enemy corvette. Navigation link established. Support is on location. Another wave of enemy forces has arrived. They must be held off at all costs. Fleet Corvette taking heavy damage. Group 1 suffering losses. Sensors indicate the Incarnate are fielding a new class of Corvette. Engage with caution. Warning. New enemy capital class transports detected. Initial scans show them to be heavily armored and optimized for rapid unit deployment. Done your kithid proud. The mothership remains secure. Enemy reinforcements are slowing. The gate remains active. Assume there will be another full assault. Use this lull to repair and redeploy. Channel open. 
Weapon, stand by. If I want you to build more supply cap. All right. Simulations show a likely increase in hostile capital ships. Reinforce defenses immediately. First, we repair our cores, and then we can use the repair bays to get those incarnate carriers spaceworthy again. I can't just yet. Intel, we have another surge building. It's the biggest yet. We need to shore up our defenses before the next attack. Quantum surge spiking. Contact imminent. Prepare for a third wave of hostiles. Damn god teams, you are the man. Another dance is about to start. Priority alert. Incarnate forces on multiple attack vectors. Control. We must defend the mothership. Alert. Multiple enemy carriers detected. Excuse me? We have pods of capture lock. Bomber production complete. Group one suffering losses. Frigate destroyed. been engaged. Caution, resource controller taking damage. Priority alert, high strike craft losses being reported. since they've had a stand-up fight. Time to remind them what it's like. Enemy frigate down. Suppression frigate is now ready. Caution, resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Mine layer frigate is now ready. Alert, resource controller integrity at 50% and falling. Warning, resource controller nearing critical. Hull integrity at 25%. 
caution. Resource controller hull integrity at 75%. Oh, gate is powering down. I read no more surges in the system. All enemy ships destroyed. Objective complete. Most complete. By Vincal's arrow, we did it! But at what cost? May the burden remain. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh. Repairs complete. Infiltration carriers report ready, Imogen. Oh. Operation Stormstrike is green to go. All right, let me... So, it is you. You always knew Clever, girl. Why did you hunt Karen? <laughs> I used my own cores to open the doors to my temple. But when I rip Karen's progenitor cores from her hull, I will unlock all the doors. Control everything effortlessly. To what end? You've already killed billions. Short-sighted girl. I have enlightened hundreds of worlds and freed billions from the burden of thought. But in all that time, and across all of that space, I had never encountered another like me. Then the gate network awoke, and for the first time in millennia, another navigator appeared. I was not alone. She gave me hope. But Karen was weak. And so I hammered at the machine, shattering worlds there. And you, you appeared. And all at once, the future came into sharp focus. I am to be the mother of a new race of navigators. Each of them born on fire. And educated by my will. Your will is a disease. I am the universe's will incarnate! Bring me Karen's course. 
devote your own to the future. Take your place by my side. And together, we will wield hyperspace like a knife. Subtle and precise. Booty. What would Karen's suggest be if Carrick had not burned? Hmm? Ponder that. It appears that it was originally a progenitor refinery and production facility. Now it is the principal base of operations for the War Sage. From there he commands the entire incarnate fleet of the Vale. In order to clear a path to Noctua 27, it is essential we eliminate this base and cripple their fleet. They'll be expecting us. That's why engineering is making our two salvaged incarnate carriers functional again. We'll use them in a two-pronged attack to deliver a strike force into the support base of the Citadel while we prepare to take out the upper structure. By destroying the resource collecting nodes located here, we will disable ship production in the main structure above. No production means no reinforcements. Indeed. If we succeed here, it will give us a fighting chance against the Incarnate. At this point, the Carcassonne will arrive for the main assault. Away team, stand by to deploy. Transports identify. Why is your data scrambled? You appear damaged. Stand by for immediate reintegration. This is Grail Leader. All wings engage initial target. Alright everyone, hope you enjoyed this video, having it all in the background, you know, stay safe and until next time.